Like a man on a mission to succeed, the new sheriff of drug law enforcement and prevention of illicit substance use does appear to have his eyes fixed on the ball as he continues to seek profitable partnership. I almost forgot the, the, the traffic. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome sir. sir. The, the chairman himself. <laughs> I have to go around. On this occasion, he's in Lagos to visit the five formations of the NDLEA, but it's making a strategic stop visit at the global headquarters of Channels Television and is being hosted by the founder and CEO of the Channels Media Group, Mr. John Momo. Natural surroundings. As they continue their conviviality through the warm reception, they all settled in this room for some chit chats. So we are grateful for the opportunity to stop by. We appreciate all the support that we received in recent uh, past and we call on more uh, advocacy from you in pursuit of a drug-free Nigeria. You, you have a partner in us, you have a friend uh, in us uh, and we'll be uh, very delighted to join you uh, in the fight against uh, uh, the drug epidemic in, in our country. He wasn't just passing by, it's a purposeful visit, recognizing the capacity Channels Media Group brings to bear and to support his aspirations. Nigeria is in a crisis of drug abuse. That's a stunning statement coming from the NDLA boss as he takes time out on the sidelines to speak to the enormity of the fight, the war, the consequences and the exit strategy. It has to go together with the drug demand reduction that is facing the addicts themselves the drug users themselves. You have to treat them in facilities. You have to equip them for the life after. I did something similar in Lagos with the area boys at the time. For him, unemployment can be linked to the rising numbers. So is drug abuse linked to the cases of insecurity? So, to successfully combat the menace, a holistic approach of public health safety, advocacy on all fronts, capacity utilization, and the buy-in of all citizens is necessary in the pursuit of a drug-free Nigeria. Olu Phillips, Channel Television News.